Hi everyone, just going to share with you my latest project. It's an altered book. I really enjoyed the last one, I really liked the one, the first one I made, which I kept for myself, and so I've had another go. This one I've used um, Artie May's Enchanted Caroline Kit 2, I think it is. It's more of a green version rather than all the pinks, and it works really, really well. So we've got an altered book, as you can see. I've taken the cover, it measures five and three eighths by eight inches. There are 96 page faces plus half pages and stuff. Didn't know what to do with the cover, with the spine, so I sort of left it as it was because it, some of it was actually quite appropriate. Um, this child is mine, nobody's dying. I don't know. I have got some sheet searching. I couldn't make my mind up whether to put some of this on it just to finish it off. I don't know. Suggestions, please. Uh, polite suggestions only in the comments below would be great. Anyway, front cover is part of the kit. I've um, done some raised embossing texture paste on the corner. If you can see that. And then there's some stickles on the flower just to bring it out a bit. And same again on the back. No stickles, but the um, the texture paste. Lovely papers. And we got a sari silk as a, a fastener through some eyelets. Oh, brass corners. So inside, where are we? There we are. This is part of the kit. I really like that. I can see me using that in lots of them. So all the printed pages. And then we've got a dragonfly belly band there. I've actually backed it onto some clear perspex just to give it a bit of body. Printed pages. I really like that picture. And then I've just put a fairy picture, I think, um, in all the... Oh, that's a flip. So she having glued it down. There we go. So a flip with a fairy. I've stenciled the plain ones just to give it a bit of something, I think. And we have a little envelope with a little fairy inside. can't remember the name of where I've got that from but I will link everything below and all that they're all lined on the back a little note card a tag this is a dreams etc fairy journeys and I've got it in the center of both signatures I've just added loads of stickles to highlight wings and things Yeah, so like that's from kit one. I do like that. With little lace pockets. This is from a, a book I picked up in a second hand shop. And with a big tag in the back. Lots of dreams, etc. page. Big side pocket. Some Sari silk type. I'm not convinced it's sorry. It was sold to me as sari silk, but compared to the two, no. More of a chiffon ribbon. Same on that side. That's the centre. I have actually put back in the um, the bookmark. They're lovely. These pages. All these images, these big ones, are all off Pinterest. Music paper, more of the printed paper. Like I say, I'll put all the, the links below. That's the cover page. 
another deep side tug a bit more of that I've dyed that one green instead Little side tuck. Lovely poem by Ye Yates. Yeats. Don't know. Lots of dreams, etc. One again. Loads of stickles on that one. Simply because I really like these. I thought that was cracking. Another one of the book pages. Big tag. There we are. Oh, that is just wonderful colours. And then the second of the envelopes with a little poem inside, another couple of tickets. Loads of space for writing on in this one, or photos, or whatever you want, really. Another dragonfly belly band. And then the back page. That's from the kit as well. From the, it's a, I'm not sure if she's called it Take Two or Enchanted Two or Add On. I don't know. Either way, it's lovely. Really, really nice kit. So there we have it. My altered book. Like I say, all the things will be listed below, and um, links to the eBay shop where I'll I'll list this as well. Thanks very much for watching. Speak to you soon.